My name is Kessler of Vlogs, and today I have another video for you all. It's Uber this time, not Lyft. This man was attacked because he wanted a passenger to wear a mask. Now, I know how dumb it sounds, but in his defense, Uber does require the passenger to wear a mask in the policy. So when they look at a people at the I want an actual ride. It says, do you have a mask? And it makes you take a picture of you having a mask on. I don't know how well their software is to identify what a mask is and what isn't, but you do, you have, you're required to, all right? You're required to, no matter how dumb it is, that is the Uber policy. But let's find out exactly why this man was attacked for asking the passenger, the passenger to wear a mask. Maybe he said a room, maybe he said it mean, maybe like, get the fuck out. And the passenger wasn't going to take that from an Uber driver with a mask on his face. But before we get into the video, make sure you guys subscribe and comment. Help me get my video out there in this jungle that we call you. So without further ado, let's find out exactly what happened. Was he rude? Let's get more details. I'm going to give you guys my final thoughts at the end of the video. Maniac for that trap so serious about wearing a mask <laughs> that you resort to violence an uber driver just trying to make sure that he and his passengers uh, were kept let me safe, myself small for you guys he was the one who were kept safe says mm. that he was the one who got safe is what they the say the share driver says he was assaulted in the short north while picking up customers <clears throat> early new year's day tonight steve levine with the confrontation caught on camera let's see it. it all started with a request to just put on a mask put on a mask Oh, I don't care about the video. started picking up Uber customers in Columbus a month ago. You got a do-rag in this hand? After on, the company man. required drivers and passengers to follow the, federal health mandates. He got the typical um, ghetto mask on his head. I said mask. Frustrated. Um, they want to take the frustrations out on basically whoever's in front of them, which is usually the driver. He looks dirty. Too. Dean says he lie. felt that frustration early New Year's Day when he picked up two passengers in the short north. Before getting in his car, a male passenger said he had a mask. His companion said she did not, but had been vaccinated. Seconds later, Dean says he was attacked. After telling <laughs> the mayor they must wear face coverings in his car. This is video. Starting his obscenities and threatening me. Punched the window. I started to get out. He opened the door, tried to pull me out. Next thing I know, he slugs me. You're kidding me right now, right? This We're thing He's complaining about the mask. Let me the see the video. Confrontation over the COVID protocols captured on Dean's dash cam. Tries to break the window right here. I try to get out. He tries to get in. Now watch him. Hear the smack. Right there. That's him hitting you. Yes. Dean reported the alleged assault to Columbus police. Bro, he's getting beat up. Good to get hit, especially a sucker punch. Uh, number two, it's humiliating. Um, in the sense that you know you're trying to do your job. In a statement, Uber tells us. The reported violence against the driver will not be tolerated. The Yo, rider this is why I don't do right here, bro. We stand ready to assist law enforcement. I'll do it sometime for some videos, but I can't I do it. Would like to be assured that he could never create an account again. Um, honestly, if I had my choice, I would like him to be banned from all rideshare services. Dean tells us that COVID confrontation room. not going to stop him you from making sure company out. health rules are followed. Yo, keep getting your, your, your AB too. The wheel. I'm trying to do the right thing. Oh. Uh. You guys got to do the right thing. On your side in Columbus. I'm going to give you guys I'm my Steve final Levine, thoughts, man. ABC this is Six News. All right, guys. So here are my final thoughts. I think it's so funny that they made sure in the beginning of the video, he's like, what is so serious about wearing a mask? Like, they're making sure they get the political point across. I noticed that. I think that's very, very funny. But I might add, they're like, the man was beaten over a mask. Like, you got the Trump supporters. Now, they didn't say that. Don't get me wrong. They didn't say that. They didn't say anything about it. But... They made sure that they made, they made sure it was like, it was all over a mask, oh my god. Like, but there was no real evidence that it was over a mask. Like, I, many times, I mean, when I did ride share, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't really give a I don't know what I'm I care so little about the mask that I never had this issue. I, I was about to be like, yeah, I never had this happen to me. Well, I don't give a F if you wear a mask or not, man. Like, we're so dang close in a, in a month effing car, right? That who, who cares, man? Like, if I'm that scared of it, I won't do the job. Like, don't do the job. You're like, yeah. I'm trying not to swear, guys. I'm trying to keep this monetized, but this Uber been on my butt, man. They really have butt, man. I'm just like, who cares? I'm trying to keep you safe. I'm trying to keep you safe. Like, if you're that scared, dude, 
bought a different job. There's so many jobs you don't have to interact with people. But this clown rather get rather get beaten. Like his was he was beaten, but he's such a drone. <laughs> He's such a drone, right? He's such like a, a mindless one. He's like, even though I'm beating, I'm, uh, I'm upholding their policies. Even though they steal money from me. Yes, Uber will steal your money, by the way. But I was just like, oh my god, I'm crying. He's like, I don't know why it's so hard. He's crying, I don't know why it's so hard. I don't know why I don't know why beat for this stuff. Man, because you're picking up drunk people that don't respect you to begin with. Like, I'm telling you, man, the times that I did, like, like actual ride show where I was picking people up, I was so disrespected, I kid you not. <laughs> I was disrespected by like the slummiest of people, dude. Like, this is why I could never go back to doing this. Like, like I said, maybe I'll do it for some videos or something like that to make you guys laugh. But like, just doing it full time all the time, I can't do it. I just can't do it. You get people throwing up in your car, people disrespecting you. I've had people masturbate. I've had people get try to get head in my car, man. I'm catching somebody with their dingling out, getting the head. I'm just like, bro, why? Why? Why, you know? And this dude's like, well, I'm about to uphold the law. Like, dude, you're gonna keep getting your, your A beat too. They're gonna keep beating you and disrespecting you because you're the clown that Uber wants. This is the exact type of people that Uber wants working for them. They don't want people like me because trust me, I will ride the wave because there's no wave anymore. I, I, I am not loyal to any company, all right? Make sure that's clear. But people like this, there's like, oh, let me make sure I uphold the policies. You'll keep getting your SB too, I promise you. You'll keep being a punching bag. Cooper and Lust were like, you know, like, yeah, he's effing his car up. He's upholding our stupid policies. <laughs> like, dude, you're an independent contract. <laughs> oh, have a spine now. I'm really trying to, I'm really trying my best not to swear. Like, this is just, it's so dumb. Have a spine, you're an independent contractor, act like it. Make your own policies. That's what I did. I did whatever I wanted when it came to that dude. Like, make your own policies. You're literally an independent contractor. You're just your own business. But you're holding someone else's policies like you're an employee. Are you stupid? But apparently he likes the beatings, guys. So, um, at a logical aspect, it's stupid. But for the drone that he is, for the minus one that he is, uh, he, he does have a right to ask them respectively to put a mask on, I'm not gonna lie. But I do believe that there are a lot more to the story than this, this. I don't know, I, 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 I've never been into like a physical fight, you know? I've had close calls, um, but I've never had anyone swing on me. Cause if someone swung on me, I, I promise y'all would be in prison. I, I kid you guys not, I really would. I, I don't play around like that. Like I, I seem really nice, all that stuff guys, but I'll just put it this way, man. I, maybe they felt it. Maybe they felt it. I always wanted someone to attack me so I could record it, maybe get a viral video, black on black crime, right? But it never happened. It, ne it never happened. I had people talk, I had people say, I'll smack the F out of you. I'm like, we'll do it then. Then like, what do you do if I smack the F out of you? I'm like, do it, find out. Let's find out. I swear this has happened, guys. This was before I had my camera recorder. But even look at some of my older videos, I had very close calls. I'm like, what? Or that guy who went to bust in my window, I'm like, okay, do it. Watch what happened. Be my guest. Cause I, I, I want to fight, I'm black, I want to fight. Like, it's already in me, you know what I mean? It's already in me, right? So, um, I, I don't know, man. Maybe they smelt, like, itch in him. If you guys get my drip, they smell uh, some itch in him. They was like, what? So, pow! Smacked him, smacked him like a woman. Like, like, dude, you got a rag on your head. I'm respecting you. I'm about to listen to what you got to say. You got a rag on your head, you know? Maybe that was it. I'm not entirely sure, guys. I'm just joking at this point, obviously. But, uh, yeah. He did have a right to, to tell them to put a mask on, but it's still it's still stupid. It's still stupid, and I feel like he's the problem why Uber don't respect their riders and why they steal money from their uh, their, their, their drivers. You know what I mean? So um, that's gonna be it for the video, guys. If you guys are new to the channel, you guys like this type of content. Make sure you guys subscribe and comment. Help me get my video out there in this jungle that we call YouTube. That's gonna be it for the video. Remember, I'm not arrogant. I'm just confident, and thank you for watching.